along the Busia Kisumu Highway. It's going to serve both Vihiga County, Busia. currently doing external and internal finishes. So the project will be completed by December this year. Waziri is because it will change the look and the life of the people in the slums. So we are very keen. For Almost at the surface state, then we have another phase of just A and tap. Sisi tunashukuru kwa foundable houses na jua kali wame tumtengenezea wame tumtengenezea smart shop. Na nikimaliza kasi jioni ni naweka vitu viangu hapa. Sisi rikali ya William Ruto na mama Achan. Tunafanya viwanda ambayo inatengeneza cassava flour different kind of materials, locally available materials, and then one other thing is that it can be designed. Yeah, because it only requires a good soil, which we verify, and then we give the public the machines. They ma So this is a very momentous moment for us. 4,000 units under construction in all these counties. Kongole, Kubwena Rais of Jamuri of Kenya. The entire built environment fraternity, present and all delegated. Afternoon. It is an honor to be before you this morning. I wish to acknowledge the efforts by the national government in being the architect. Bomayangu Week is all about enabling every Kenyan to use the possessive expression my home and that is why our theme is housing the nation and empowering the future for the rest of the week we shall reflect on the remarkable progress that we have made since 2022 when the government launched the affordable housing program as a strategic pillar of the bottom-up economic transformation agenda it is important for us to mobilize our collective capabilities to drive our mission, which is not merely to build houses, but also to uplift communities, improve living standards, and lay the foundation for sustainable prosperity for all Kenyans. Our country continues to urbanize at a steady annual rate of 4.3 percent. By 2050, more than half of our population, which is projected to be 48 million, will reside in urban areas. The demand for housing is therefore bound to rise significantly in the coming years. To address this, the government is implementing the second phase 
of the Kenya Urban Support Program, KUSIP II, to support urban infrastructure and service delivery by fortifying urban institutions in 79 municipalities across 45 counties and ensuring that they are ready to meet the challenges of rapid urbanization.